<laughs> Maybe some fish have balls. Uh, I'm using my Murmur's, Murmur's uh, recipe. Murmur directly translated means mother's mother. <laughs> It is the end of March, and Easter vacation is only a week away. The weather seems to be just as up and down as my bipolar moods are. This time of year is often hard, and our honeybees may be in for a late start here in southeast Norway. I know spring is coming, just a few more weeks. In the meantime, I observe the gradual changes in temperature. Yeah, it's that time of year again. It's um, it's not exactly winter anymore. No, it's uh, it's plus degrees, three, four plus degrees. But I mean, that's not very warm either. That's only just above freezing. <laughs> but it is mild. The thing is, things are melting. Snow is melting. I see running water over here. But it's uh, it's that in-between phase. It's it's not winter anymore, but it's not spring either. And I'm just dying for spring. Bring on the warm weather. Bring on the green grass. But it's nice. I can hear the waterfall. It's melting. Little birds are out and about and it's lovely, it's lovely. Hey-ya, hey -ya. hey -ya, Bella. hey -ya. Oh, Bella's getting old. She's getting blind. Poor baby girl. She's a baby girl. Yeah. Sweetie. <laughs> you hear the birdies? You hear the birdies? Yeah? You hear the birdies? Yeah, the snow this time of year is even, it's, it's kind of rotten. It's melting, it's, it's heavy, it's wet, and it's, it's hard to walk on it. I mean, some areas it's up to my hips, so it's hard to move around. I'm just waiting for it to melt, and it, it actually rained last night, so that was nice. I could hear the rain on the windows, but it was so slippery when we woke up this morning to go out go to the store just out front of the house it's so icy it's slippery and yucky yeah Bella she stays close by my side <laughs> poor girl she can't really see so well but she smells her way around she listens to my foot tracks and she knows where I am I just wanted to take this moment to say thank you so much for watching. If you are a subscriber, that's fantastic. If you haven't subscribed yet, just hit the button down below and hit the like button because it really helps out our channel a lot. It helps us grow. Yeah, I will. I'm on my way to uh, dig out the bees. They are completely covered in snow. Oh my god. Hello. You feel it? 
show me my fat ass. <laughs> And the Druid snowshoes. I should have put the snowshoes on. Yeah. Yeah. I forgot to use my brain. Yeah. It's probably smart using your brain. Mm hmm. I'll uh, consider it for soon enough. The bees are generating heat, so snow has been melting around the hive. I think I will leave it at that. I'm not gonna. I'm going to dig them completely out. <laughs> and the way it is now, they, if they want to find their way out, they can. But now the sun will uh, sort of reach and start melting. Okay. Hello. <laughs> it is so good to finally start to see bare asphalt again. The snow on the side of the road is dirty and not very pretty. And it is an overcast day, which makes me appreciate sunny days even more. We are on our way to a town called Dokka to shop. We are recycling bottles and uh, they, Norway has a system it's pretty cool. It's like you rent the bottle and it costs three crowns, which is about 30 cents. So you rent the bottle and then you return it to one of these uh, recycling stations and you get the money back. scans the barcode and it keeps track of how much money you get back. It even takes cans, so that's great. Oh, couldn't read the... I don't know if I can get that sticker off, but it... This one was on sale, so... It's not getting to the barcode. I don't think it's going to take it. Oh, I spit it back out. <laughs> and that's it. So uh, we get 42 crowns back, which is about $4.20. And to get the money back, you push the green button. So this goes to the register and we'll get 42 crowns back. If I had pushed here, there's actually a lottery for the Red Cross. Uh, the proceeds go to the Red Cross, but you can actually win a pretty considerable amount of money. <laughs> so, but we'll take our 42 crowns. So here we have an example of the Pepsi Max and here is what you pay extra. So this is the price, 69 crowns uh, for six pack and you pay an extra 7 crowns 67 to rent the bottles. Another one of my favorites, a cool food in Norway, it's chocolate covered bugles. <laughs> Who would have thought it? They're really good and they're called Smash and we have in Norway, we have a lot of food that comes in tubes that look like toothpaste tubes. So, we got the squeezable shrimp cheese. <laughs> this one's really good. Cheddar and chorizo. Chicken. Regular ham and cheese. 
Mmm, bacon and cheese. So yummy. And it's also very popular to eat caviar with, especially on eggs. Mills, the caviar, fish eggs. Kids love it. I don't. <laughs> and you also got the mayonnaise. And this is kind of funny. I can't open it up to show you, but well, maybe yeah, I should. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I can. I'll show you. I'll buy it. it comes in a bag. <laughs> mayonnaise in a bag. That's so silly. Yeah, you just cut the corner. You cut the corner and, and you can it, squeeze it out. It's squeeze smart. It out. Yeah, it's smart, but it's kind of weird. No, you gotta it's admit, smart. It's weird. It's gotta, gotta, gotta. <laughs> And another thing uh, people love here is liver pate. And for some reason, there's a picture of a kid on the liver on the liver pate. I don't know why. It's just one of those quirky. Because kids like it. Quirky it's not like things. we're eating kids. <laughs> I didn't say that. I didn't say that. You're nuts. <laughs> it's delicious. Yeah. So we also have this weird thing called soft or saft in English, like I like to say saft. <laughs> and it's uh, it's basically like this juice that's really concentrated and you have to blend it out with a, like a lot of water, like one to ten with water. And there's different kinds and usually it's without sugar. So fun life. <laughs> it's in English for zero zero calories and uh, but it's, it's a very popular Norwegian thing, so... But it's a healthier alternative to soda. Definitely. And, um, but the water is just so good in Norway. Do you really need this stuff? And guess what we're having for dinner? This says... Wait, here's a picture of it. On the cheaper one. Here we go. These are fish balls. <laughs> Like meatballs, but they're made out of fish. So it's not the balls from the fish? <laughs> it's so bad balls. <laughs> I don't know. Do you know every fish? <laughs> Maybe some fish have balls. Stop it. <laughs> we get one can or two. Enough of one. Ah, uh, we need a lot of balls. <laughs> <laughs> yes. No. Bring me that yellow can no. there. Do as you're told. <laughs> you're told. I'm not eating it. Yes, you are. That's nope. my favorite. You can eat it then. It's good. This is mackerel and tomato. And just the smell when you open this up. It's delicious. And uh, and over here we have the knackkibber, which is translated to breaking bread. So it's kind of like a cracker, but they're pretty good for you. Um, this one's actually made with sourdough. So they're, they're crispy and they're good and delicious and a good alternative to bread. Less calories. But less calories means less butt. <laughs> and we don't want that. We definitely don't want that. There you go. This is a self-checkout. It's pretty cool. You just scan your own items. And I got my 42 crowns back. I scanned, scanned this so from the bottles. Looking good looking. I'm making the fish balls. They're delicious. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy man. Alright, let's tell our viewers what fish balls are because I think they really want to know. Fish balls. They're not balls from fish. <laughs> My god. <laughs> Norwegians, they mince up uh, meat and fish. And they make uh, fish balls. 
-hmm. Just like you can do with the meat. Okay. It's so called meatballs. Then. They're rolled up together. Yes. Okay. Uh, I'm using my Murmur's, Murmur's uh, recipe. Murmur directly translated means mother's mother. Yeah. She's good. She knew how to cook. What you got there, T? It's a uh, curry. Curry seasoning. And I have the butter simmering. And you measure this up very accurately. Oh, I see this. Not. Mm -hmm. You just dump as much as you think. And I think like that. Yeah. And you add a little bit of flour. I have no idea how much. You just wing it. This is for the sauce. Oh, it smells good. Yeah, it smells good. See, the thing is that if you put the spice in together with the butter, it will uh, explode the pop the flavor. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Taking notes. Taking notes. A little bit of uh, fatty milk. There you go. And these fish bowls, which are not bowls from fish. <laughs> I think we got that squared away. We didn't cover that. But they, they That's look, what all the Americans think. They look crazy. They definitely look crazy. You think about meatballs, <laughs> but fish. This liquid, which they are in, mm -hmm. is actually the blood of the fish. It is not. No, it's not. <laughs> crazy. <laughs> it is just fish stock. It's like salt water, isn't it? No. No. It's just stock from when they boil the fish bowls. Okay. They're pre boiled. You can, you can eat them directly from the can. Mm hmm. They smell uh, slightly fishy. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. You see? Yeah, I see. See the marks from my teeth? <laughs> Yeah, so they mix it with fish and flour and just make a dough out of it, basically. Yeah, you can you can uh, film that. Oh, it's like minced fish mixed with the other stuff you like. It's made with cod. Come and have a look, see. Mm -hmm. Film ski in here a ski. It's very yellow. Huh? It's very yellow. No, it's a uh, curryish. Yeah, fine. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And the important thing is that not to add extra salt. No. I just add a little bit of uh, garlic powder because mm -hmm. I like it. Don't tell. Don't tell my grandma. How is it? Ooh. <laughs> it's not a secret recipe. Every Norwegian family. <laughs> make this dish uh, twice a month at least because mm. the kids love this mm -hmm. because it's good it tastes it's good. good and it's nutrient nutritious 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 yes oh, god that's a beautiful word yeah taste it is it hot <laughs> with your red editing uh, whatever bandana, bandana. <laughs> so nice mm -hmm. I see this look at that sexy microphone over there. <laughs> Ooh, la, la. is that what you do your voiceover <laughs> oh your voice oh I like your voice <laughs> Only in Norway can you find a road sign for ski crossing. Be careful of moose, wandering reindeer, and fart humper.
Boom ski and hero ski. <laughs> Stockers and cooking some solar for Duken. <laughs> mm.